Um, I'm here to draw parallels between the two bloated and I feel inappropriate parks and recreation projects, the Hilo Municipal Golf Course and Kukui Highly Park Project. A group of residents are also trying to be heard. It has to do with the rush to get the project done before Billy Canoy leaves office. For two weeks, they crashed council committee meetings, only to be told their issue with the new ball field being constructed in their neighborhood was not on the agenda. The park's rolling hills have been ripped up. They're just Point of order. Just real quickly. And I don't mind you continuing, but like I said, like the last committee meeting, if they get to testify off subject, because this is about overtime, mm -hmm. and uh -huh. Kukuhaili Highly Park is not part of overtime, they're... they're uh, has nothing to do with overtime at the Kuka Highly Park. That was stated by it, It's Parks more about the finance yeah. department okay. and the so, fact okay. that um, the uh, overtime. Yeah. Can I just state my point of order Go first? ahead, finish. Okay. Their brief appearance at Tuesday's finance committee meeting in Hilo stirred debate among council members. It doesn't really mention about overtime for that, but then, but it doesn't mention about Kuka Highly. We shouldn't be trying to narrowly construe it. I am disappointed. And I feel as a taxpayer that uh, no good comes from this rushing business. Uh, not, to ex not to even respect when uh, people are in court and something hasn't been decided and yet the bulldozers roll. I really need more understanding. My neighbors need more understanding. There's great um, distrust of of our government, and yet we live under it. The mayor decides what's going to happen where, and that's what gets done. And so that if it's one of his pet projects, he's going to move it, and even move it so that if we have to pay 100000 in overtime, or 20000 of overtime there, that he wants to be able to cut the ribbon. Um, and that if he doesn't care about a project, and he doesn't care about certain council members, then um, they're down on the bottom of the totem pole. And that's what happens, and we give the power, this much power to the mayor, that it can be run as a little kingdom, that's what happens. And I think that it's all about abuse of power, or where the power is. And I think um, with all the things that we could um, do with 100,000 that Ms. was Lee, good for chair. overtime, Ms. Lee, it's on the that by finishing oh, up, cut it. Well, you can yeah, call it recess. Okay. And I'm it's saying yeah. why it's important to postpone it and not do it right okay, and not you. go through it. So um, I think that it is important and they should be here and be accountable. And I think it's also under that other, um, you know, the, the other bill that we did. So um, I, I don't, you know, I'm not agreeing with you or this in terms <laughs> of Kukuli Highly. It's just the way we manage Madam things. Chair. And it's why it's important. You say what you want to say. Um, and uh, that's why it's important that we postpone it so they can be here and, and they can be, we can be accountable to the public.